The Ariane 5, ESA's workhorse rocket for over two decades now. After some early failures in the 1990s, it turned into one of the most reliable launch vehicles in the industry. This final flight, carrying two satellites, one French, one German, will be the series' 117th mission. Earlier ones included groundbreaking science expeditions, like the launch that carried the Rosetta space probe, which went on to liaise with a comet and land on one for the first time. Or the Baby Colombo mission, a seven-year journey to Mercury, its paired satellites will only settle into stable orbit around the solar system's innermost planet in late 2025. And then there was the Ariane 5's most famous passenger, the James Webb Space Telescope, which within just months after launch began delivering stunning pictures of the universe around us. The Ariane 6 will replace the Ariane 5 as the European heavy lift rocket of choice. Its three-stage design will be able to heave over 20,000 kilograms into low Earth orbit and around half that payload into higher geostationary orbits at a significantly lower cost than its predecessor. Its development, however, has been marked by delays and it still isn't clear when the Ariane 6 will go up for the first time. We are not uh, mentioning yet um, a launch uh, date or a launch period. We're having some critical technical milestones over summer, especially also two of the tests that are, um, that are in preparation. And these two tests, of course, will de uh, define and determine on uh, the um, uh, further progress of uh, uh, getting the Ariane 6 launch uh, for its inaugural fl uh, flight on the launch pad. But for now, it's time to say goodbye to a legendary rocket. The Ariane 5 will be a tough act to follow, high up into the Earth's atmosphere and beyond. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.